how are you doing you're welcome to a new class we are going to learn a new topic which is what a super machine which is a super machine in your previous classes you've learned about what a machine is and we know that a machine is made by man okay and now in this class we want to learn about the super machine we want to learn about the what the super machine okay we also know that computer is a machine computer is what a machine computer helps us to do our work very fast makes us to do our work very easy it also saves our time when we use the computer to do our work with the help of the computer we can do a lot of things so we know that the computer is an electronic device but let's look at the various types of what computers the various what types of computers so you have seen various types of computers but you might not know their names or you know their names but in this class we will be clarified on their names what are those types of computers that we have seen or that we have used okay the first type of computer is the what a desktop what computer it's what a desktop computer now this is a desktop computer why do we call it a desktop computer we call it a desktop computer because it's always placed on the desk it always plays on the desk and it is called a desktop computer because it has a, a, a system unit which is called the CPU or a monitor it has the keyboard and a mouse okay so this is what a desktop computer it is called a desktop computer because it is placed on a desk now a desktop computer can also be called a PC can also be called PC PC stands for what personal computer PC is an acronym for personal computer so it is the most common types of computers I think right now you've seen the desktop computer and I know that you have made use of this desktop computer you have this desktop computer in your schools you have this desktop computer in the computer lab okay and I know you can also mention some other areas you have seen the desktop computer now this is a desktop computer it is also called a personal computer okay now let's learn about the second type of computer which is the word the laptop computer this is what a laptop computer we have seen you have seen your dad taking or your mom taking this laptop computer to work a laptop computer is very easy to carry it is portable to carry compared to the desktop computer the desktop computer we cannot carry everything you have the monitor you have the system unit that is the cpu you have the keyboard and you have the mouse it will be a problem carrying what the desktop computer because the desktop computer is heavy to carry but the laptop computers are smaller in size they are what smaller in size they are portable we can carry it everywhere a, desk, a laptop computer can be carried around your parents do carry your carry the laptop computer in their bags and take it to the office but they cannot carry their desktop computer everywhere so this is what a laptop computer it is smaller in size another type of computer is the palm top computer we say palm top computer look at it palm top computer why do we call it palm top computer because this type of computer can be placed on the palm it is a very small computer it just fits into the palm now you can see from the image here this person is carrying his palm top computer he plays the palm top computer on his palm it is called a palm top computer now some of these palm top computers can be put right inside our pocket right inside our pocket <coughs> excuse me can be put right inside our pocket so this is what a palm top computer a palm top computer is smaller than the word laptop computer the palm top computer is smaller than the word laptop computer it's very small it's just like a mobile phone it's just like what a mobile phone but this is what a palm top computer now another type of computer is the word super computers super word computers as the name implies this is really a super computer okay 
Now, have you watched Superman? You've watched Superman. Superman is really super. So the computer also has uh, computers also have a super what computer. Now this is an example what of a super computer. This is a very gigantic computer, a very huge computer, and it performs very fast. It's very fast in performing things. This computer is mostly used by scientists. This computer is mostly used by who? Scientists. It is called the what? The super computers. It is called the word super computers. It is very fast in processing. It is very what? Fast in processing. Okay. So we can use these computers in our offices. Now, outside this computer, there are also other machines that can be found in our home. Remember, as we learned, refrigerator, air conditioner is found in our home, television is found. Also, the computer is also found in your home so please make sure you remember all of these things so this is a supercomputer now if you have the different types of computers what do we do with the different types of computers what do we do with the what different types of computers 